Very frequently, new users aren't sure why their bottle or their diffuser stops working. Sometimes it can happen in the first year, sometimes it can happen in the first day. More and more, because people are buying cheaper or unfiltered oils, not low quality oils, just unfiltered oils that have small particulate in them, um, the number of clogs has been increasing and we want to show people how to quickly identify whether the bottle is clogged. So this is a bottle that we received from a customer that said the diffuser is broken. And they say, I don't see any, any clogs in the bottle. So if you were to look at it with your eye from a distance, it's actually somewhat difficult to identify that there's any kind of issue in this bottle. Right, even if you look closely. So what you're going to do is, you're going to take the bottle, you're going to find a bright background. A white background sometimes work, but the best background is some kind of light. So if you were to find a light, hold your bottle up to a light, and hold your phone up to the light, your phone will adjust to the brightness and you'll be able to see that inside, right there on the left side, is a gray mass that is stuck in the straw or the straight tube of your bottle. Okay, so all I'm gonna do is add some, a little bit of 91% rubbing alcohol in there. And I'm gonna use the pipette. And I'm gonna flush it out. Notice I'm using a real jet to try to push backwards. And every little squirt helps dissolve whatever's in there. And eventually, as you can see, it's almost, almost out. But this is this kind of clog um, is called a crystallization, and and it's out. I don't know if you can see it, but you now have bubble. Okay, here's your base. And I'm just going to diffuse the alcohol. Diffusing. So it wasn't an issue with the base. No issue with this bottle. Just needed to clean that one out with the pipe out a little bit more um, vigorously.